everyone. How are y'all today? For supper tonight, we're having fried oysters. My husband likes to cook all the seafood, so I thought I would just <clears throat> quickly show y'all how he does our oysters. Now keep in mind, everybody does theirs differently, and I'm sure you won't hesitate to tell me how you do yours. And some of y'all's suggestions I, f I really find refreshing. So I hope you know that you can learn something new by the way we do it. And um, this is what you'll need. So let's get cooking. What you will need is your, whatever you're gonna use to dip your oysters in before you put them in your oil. Um, we use Zatarain's fish fry, it's not seasoned. Um, flour is okay, cornmeal only is okay, or you can mix flour and cornmeal to do it. You don't have to use the fish fry like I do. So um, be creative and use what you want. But this is what we use, the fish fry. Of course, we have our oysters. And we have our fish fry in our little shaky container here. But you don't have to, if you don't have one of these, then you can just use a bowl or whatever. And then of course we have our oil. So let's get started. We don't dip our oysters in anything and they're in their natural juice. We don't wash them off because we like it this way. But if you wanna wash your oysters, dip them in egg before you put them in your mixture, that's fine. We just use the natural juices because we the egg will make your batter thicker on your oyster and we don't really like a lot of thick batter on our oyster. So we've got our oysters covered and we're putting them in our hot oil, which is canola oil. This is a deep fry. Okay, with cooking oysters or cooking fish, they will float when they're done. So what we're looking for is for them to start floating in the deep oil that we have, and then we know they're ready to take out. My husband wanted to tell you that he's cooking them at, the oil is 350 degrees. As you can see, they're browning up nicely. And they're starting to float. There you go. It only took a couple of minutes. And the really hot oil. Mm, mm, mm. They smell wonderful. So that's all there is to cooking oysters. Mm, mm, mm. Put your oysters in whatever you're going to dip them in. Flour, cornmeal, flour, cornmeal, fish fry. And put them in your 350 degree oil. If not, you can put an oyster in your oil and when it's really bubbling good, rolling, bubbling good, then you can add the rest of the oysters. You can do it that way too. And then you cook them until they float and then they're a golden brown. And that's all there is to it. Takes you what? Less than five minutes. And that's what they look like.
Going back into the hot oil. Then we'll wait for them to float. We'll take them out. And there's your finished product. So there you go, everybody. Have fun cooking your oysters. Mm -mm -mm. So until my next video, happy eating.